good kitten internet, where we last left off, our party decided to all contract rabies. Because that's a lot better than the actual connotation about the status effect name that it, they actually have. Anyway, we had just finished off um, the maze, which is a dungeon that you're really not supposed to be here right now. And we're going to be heading back into town to return Halder's remains. Also, we have our first statuette. The other two statuettes are in even more an island, which we won't be going to for a while. Kind of want to just edit the game's files to say rabies instead of insane. I can probably do that, actually. So I've actually done quite a bit of hacking into the files of the Might Magic games. Uh, That's the reason why, if anybody looks, I have an extremely comprehensive FAQ from Might Magic 8. That's a bestiary. And the reason why it's so comprehensive is that I actually cracked open the game's files and looked at all of the stats and so on. And wrote a script to make it pretty when it outputs, and yeah, I basically wrote a script to write an FAQ. So, um, Haldor is over here. Ah, the Lords of Harmondale. Perhaps you can be of assistance to me with the flaming pentagram in the middle of the room. Thank you for returning my brother's remains. He was a promising warlock, and his life ended too soon. Now that I have his remains, I will attempt to bring him back as a lich. And together, we will seek greater power and glory. The, mm, warlocks aren't necessarily nice, but, you know. That's fine. I'm sure that's what Halder would have wanted. Anyway, let's go cure these ra this rabies. Ugh. <sighs> I'm here during the one hour of the day that I can't actually... Screw it. Um, and portal. Clarion Forest. Just because this is the easy to reach temple from the town portal location. How may we help you? There we go. Walk in the light. Goodbye. Alright, so we also have our answer for what we're going to be doing for the war. We're going to have Harmondale win. Now, I'm not going to do all of these yet. What I'm going to end up doing is I'm going to wait until we have the third quest, which will trigger soon. Uh, do we have the glitch? No, the glitch. I think they've actually patched out the glitches. Uh, I'll explain that in a moment. But that way I can save right before. Oh, this finally finished. Um, well, I'm getting distracted. Let me finish my current talk, then I'll start switching. Um... So yeah, I want to get a save right before and redeem everything. That way I can show you all the cutscenes from the other ways of doing this. Really, there's only two cutscenes, even though there's six potential outcomes of this war. So yeah. Um, second thing. Uh, during the war quest line, there's two glitch quests that appear here. And they're not quite glitched as in... Hey, look, they shouldn't be there. They're actually intentional. Um, the intentional, or the unintentional part is you actually seeing them. So you'll have a quest here that just has the number zero. And then a second quest that has two zeros. Uh, the first number zero means that the war is started. So you'll start seeing fights in, was it, is the fights actually in Harmondale or the fights in Tulerian Forest? I don't remember exactly where the fights end up appearing. Um... And then two zeros means that we're ready for the second quest, if I remember right. Or it might be that the first zero means that the second quest has started, and the second double zero means that the quest time has ended. Anyway, we don't have either of those. I'm going to do a quick double check to make sure that we don't have the quest trigger over here. And you have to be really careful. So, Might Magic 6, trying to complete all of the quests was just a matter of doing it. In Might Magic 7, trying to complete all the quests, the difficulty in completing all the quests isn't actually doing it so much as finding all the quests to do, because it's there's a lot of side quests, and you can miss them in Might Magic 7. In Might Magic 6, you might just not find it to begin with, because there's a bunch. In Might Magic 8, the difficulty is neither of those. The difficulty is actually... I never looted this. Uh, the difficulty in Might Magic 8 is accidentally permanently... Um, ruining the mainline plot of Might Magic 8, which you can do by accident. 
Uh, the other thing I was going to mention, come on, is that I have a new toy. So I have this, let's see if you can see it all. Plug it really fast. I have this Windows 8 tablet. Um, I had ordered it a while back. It's actually been stuck at my work since I've been unavailable. And finally got a friend of mine to return it here. And I've already started breaking it. What is it with me and devices and breaking them so easily? Anyway, um, let me just have this continue for a moment. There we go. Anyway, um, for some reason, if I tell Chrome to download a file, the council is in session. Just a file does not matter what. It will start hanging Chrome break the networking stack and then sit there and look pretty if you were to try to ping something else it'll work just fine and then when you reopen chrome it'll be sod i haven't done anything with this machine literally the only program i have installed is chrome it's running windows 8 um i had downloaded the windows 10 upgrade but it glitched during the whole hey look i'm going to try to um, mess with your networking stack bit and cat bookkeepies here anyway so we still have time to kill how leveled are we that one quest allowed us to level up five times no no not five times four times or five times in her case okay so we definitely have enough xp to level up not the correct time of day. Let's take a look at our quest log. Um, do, 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 do. One note, there we go. So, um, nothing we can do in Raytheon yet because I want to make sure I have a save ready for that. Uh, Bricado Desert quest. The only thing we need to go is even more. We need to return the paintings to Tatalia. But I don't want to go back to Tatalia until after we're done with the war quest line. This one is now complete, which means we're actually done with Nyon for a while. Um, we've got the statuette now. And that's it. Make sure I don't have any quests missing from here. Nope. That's it. So... Yeah. Let me go hop over to Castle Harmondale. Make sure I don't need to trigger something. So, um, you'll actually start seeing flags in Castle Harmondale when you return things to redeem the war quest line. No. There's nothing else here. Um, what was that in here? No. Anyway, um, you'll notice that there's no flags at all right now, and that indicates basically that you haven't done a single work quest. Nope, nothing, okay. Well, let's make ourselves a temporary save. I'm gonna save down here. Well, first, let's make a real save. Then let's make a temporary save down here. And let's go complete these quests. So, the way I've decided I want to do it is that I'm going to be a, a dick. Now that it's actually opening time around here. Prisoner of War. Good job. You really solved a terrible dilemma for me. Catherine turns to Lauren and shakes his hand. Lauren, it's good to meet you at last. Since everyone knows who you are now, you're not much too good to me as a spy, but I would like to offer you a job in the Royal Diplomatic Corps. Please give it some thought. As for our heroes, you have my thanks. My purser will credit your bank account with 5,000 gold pieces for your services. Oh, and also, 
You stole the plans. The queen raises her eyebrows with interest as you tell her how you infiltrated her fort, stole her secret plans, and killed many of her guards while in the service of a foreign king. I wish I could truthfully say this is the most shocking treason I've ever witnessed, but unfortunately it's not. And nonetheless, guards off with their heads. Anyway, I just wanted to do that for fun. Well, I don't need to walk out of here. So now if we go to Castle Harmondale, we should see a flag. Where are, where is the flag? I could have swore there was a flag thing that happened. Is it on the outside? Does the war have to progress further? Huh, that's weird. Anyway, we're going to complete the other one while we're at it. So, I was going to do the um, screw both sides over, but then I forgot about the fact that you can't actually do that when you have already completed the other part of the quest. Anyway. Whee! Thank you! These will be very helpful. My factor will deposit 5,000 gold pieces in your bank account. Services rendered. When we finally win this round against Raytheia, I will not forget you. So yeah, they actually, uh, both of them deposit money into your bank account rather than giving you money. I can totally see the reason why they do that. If I was a king, that would probably be the way that I would expect to react. You give people letters of credit. You don't deal with money yourself. Ugh. It's for commoners. Anyway. Um. And nothing. Hmm. This is weird. Oh, that could have been bad. <laughs> and I'm assuming I can't train Need here. Some training? Yeah. So the only place that we can train that we can town portal to right now is Nyon, and it's the wrong time of day to do that. Uh, we're going to have to do some overland travel, aren't we? Oh, I have to finish cleaning the dead bodies over here. How dare I? I should clean up my own land, thank you very much. I am a lord of Farmandale, after all. Welcome back, my lords. Arathia and Avli are at each other's throats again. Feeling the heat yet? Once again, the human kingdom of Arathia and the elvish kingdom of Harmondale are fighting. That's not actually accurate. That's a mistake in the thing. It should be the elvish kingdom of Avli are fighting. Anyway, as the local judge, it's fallen to me to patch up their differences and bring the two sides to the negotiating table. The two sides are very evenly matched, that either could prevail. The judge leads closer to you, lowering his voice, and I'll tell you something else. I don't much care anymore who wins. They're like children fighting over a toy. Neither really wants Harmondale, they just want to deny it to the other. So, you're on your own. Whatever actions you take in support of one side or the other could really make a difference. Just remember that they couldn't possibly care less what happens to you or who rules in Harmondale. Protect yourselves and the, your people first. We didn't have this conversation. And I never had it, as usual. So yeah, we're going to go independent. Now, I've actually never done inde <clears throat> this particular uh, combination. I have never actually done. You are probably a garbage mm. cloak. Better than I was expecting. You're still a garbage cloak. Hmm. We're just killing time, by the way. Oh. Oh, let's sell stuff. That'll help kill t some time. My inventory is so full I can't pick up these boots. So they're just going to be in my hands as I fly. Zoom through the air like Superman with boots on my hands. Wait. Superman has boots on his hands, right? Anyway... <laughs> Right. See anything you want? So, I don't want to sell the plate mail yet. I'm so close to actually having. This is worthless. Um. Hmm. Oh, wrong character. That explains it. It's like I don't want to sell those hmm. things yet. What a piece of junk. Yeah, I'll sell the shield though. Boots.
Thanks a lot. Yeah. Need a new weapon? I need to be at double speed for selling stuff. That doesn't make much sense. Um, yeah, that trident's not very good. We like trident. I don't. Those headman's pole axes are actually really good weapons, but I don't have anybody using axe this time. Uh, I shouldn't have sold the sword. Oh well, not a big deal. Forgot I can dual wield. And I wanted to try out dual wielding with the sword. Bang. Okay, let's move weapons that I'm going to be selling over. Uh, am I even gonna bother using that damn flail? Probably not. Let's just sell it. Let's sell. I'm gonna keep the leather armor for the time being. Let's sell. Let's sell. So. I'm going to keep the helms because I can enchant them and I don't really have that great of helms right now. Actually, cast the spell for that now. Spirit Lash is a garbage spell. Where will I put that? Excellent question. I'm almost to the point of being able to eat all of these apples. Uh, in fact, that might actually end up happening this episode. Because we have a lot of traveling to do this episode. Okay, um, your inventory is cleared out for things that I care about. Hmm. It's actually a nice ring. Why are you not wearing it? There we go. Uh, Four inventory spots available, which will allow me to use those over there. Okay. Um, at some point off camera, I'm probably going to start. <clears throat> um, probably going to start organizing inventory again. I want to wait until after the war is done for it, though. Wait, didn't I already finish that painting quest? Let me take a look really fast. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. No, I need to return it to Talia. Right, okay. But shouldn't I have both paintings? I only see one in my inventory. No, nope, there's the other one. Okay. Sorry, just no got confused for a moment. Uh, yeah, you definitely don't have room for that. Um, let's rearrange a little bit. You really shouldn't be holding these potions on your person. Oops. That you can hold. There. Now you should be able to hold that because you're going to hold quest items and stuff we're holding on to for a bit. Back to no room your for that. Inventory. Um, make sure we sell those things. Okay, I think we finally have There's no room everything for that. that's going to be sold. Success. Just go in there. That'll do. Need a new weapon? Hmm. Thanks. There we go. Come again. See anything you want? No, I'm not going to buy anything from you. You have garbage items. All right. Magic items all over everything else. Which is right here. Can I help you with Otto's anything? oddities. Oh, I shouldn't have a genie lamp in her inventory. There. Thanks. 
much better. I don't need the money for any of this. I should probably start looking into just dropping things, to be honest, but meh, that's okay. All right, we have killed nowhere near enough time. Okay. Still need to kill an hour and a half. What do you have? A priest of the sun. I am not going to encounter any of those for a while. Uh, let's see, you're adept guilds, right? Adept and initiate. Maybe visit some magic guilds. Yeah. Oh, well, there's one thing that we can do. It's not very useful, Welcome but we can do it. Guild. We can finally get him the other two elements he's missing. Welcome to the air. There we go. Now he could theoretically learn how to cast these lovely fire, air, water, and earth magics where he can max out at basic. I really don't even know why. It matters. Why did they even bother giving it to him? It's so worthless. Okay. We've already walked through that passage. Okay. Um, I don't think we're going to be able to make the spirit guilds over here quickly enough before they close because they should be closing at five. The guild of the body welcomes you. Okay. Body magic, we're not mastered right now, and we already bought those. So that's not the one that I want. The this guild is. of the spirit welcomes you. Okay. Once we're master spirit, we can learn spirit lash. The guild of the spirit welcomes you. We can learn you. raise dead. That's better. And shared life. I'll learn Spirit Lash, I guess, but I won't be happy about it. I can't wait to use the I learned it. I can't wait to use this. And then you are at a field, so you're not gonna have anything I care about. Right. Maybe they close at six. It's worth a shot. I need to waste time anyway, so. Welcome to the Earth Guild. I do have Stone Flesh, right? Yeah, I have Stone Flesh. I've accidentally cast it a couple times. Master Fire. Welcome to the Fire Guild. Uh, Immolation. Immolation's a weird spell. Basically, if things get in melee range, it'll start hitting them constantly. Hmm. Sure, why not? I've got tons of money. Ah, learned a new you actually have um, three of the four at Master, yeah. And you already had some other Masters anyway. Welcome to the Air Guild. Uh, what do we have? Implosion, Invis. Did I actually already learn Implosion? Uh, no. Welcome to the Air Guild. Okay. Implosion's a nice spell because it does physical damage. Which can be really useful. Um, more importantly, it's you know, more attack spells. And this is only Adept. I already have everything that's for Adept. Not to mention the Master Water Guild is actually a Nyan anyway. So, I'm gonna go to the bank. Your gold is safe with us. Withdraw my money, because why? Just why? And let's go back to Nyon. All right. Pick up Invis. Let's head over to the, is that Paramount Fire? Yeah, Paramount Fire. I don't it's think. closed. Isn't it 6 p.m.? No, not quite. Okay. That's right. We already cleaned out the Paramount Fire, so that's not going to be of use. We need to level up. So the way I'm going to do this is I'm going to level up everybody once.
Okay. So it is currently December 7th. Our traders never get excellent. Excellent. I want to see if this works. Yeah, no. That was definitely Our too long. Excellent. Okay. So that's the week. Uh, do we have push quests? No, we have no... We have one page of quests. Alright, let's go ahead and TP over to Castle Harmondale. New flag still. Hmm. Am I being too conservative? Nothing. Head over to the Tularian Forest. Come on. Thank you. Fly. I might just be trying to do this too fast. Now that I'm thinking about it. Oh, I went the wrong direction. <laughs> it's nighttime. That's my excuse. How are you? Oh, I can turn off one now. I don't really need it up at all times or anything. It's just, it's helpful. Oh, let's have Wizard Eye up, because it's going to be the only way I'm going to be able to tell if bad things are happening. And nothing. Our Fine, I'll level up twice. Excellent. Excellent. I might just be doing this too fast. No flags. Quest log has no glitched quests, but again, I think that might have been fixed from an unofficial patch. This is weird. I should have hit this by now. I don't know why I hit that. It doesn't matter. Because we started the war quest at the start of December. We're at the end of December now. Speaking of, we can probably start using those genie lamps. Huh. If I level up one more time, I'm gonna hit January, I think. Oh no, I know I would hit January. By the way, what do we get this month anyway? Plus four body resistance? Ugh. I'd rather keep the genie lamps anyway. All right, Our let's do it three times. Excellent. Excellent. Maybe it's four weeks after you actually return those quests? I definitely should have triggered this by now. I'm really confused. Did I somehow glitch the game? I don't think I did. Was the maximum level up I can do. I know if I go too far, I'm going to get a messenger the moment I go anywhere. How have I not triggered the war? I am so confused right now. There we go. 
My lords, I have received an urgent message from the Arathian ambassador for you. I'm told the details of this important event that is happening right now, and you should read it immediately. Here's the letter. So this is a hint that if I were to finish it right now, I would, um, whatchamacallit, um, Arathia would end up winning the war. And that's the default, basically. So if you do all the quests the normal way, quote-unquote, and you don't get this quest, Arathia wins. Years ago, in a previous war, the elves stole an artifact from us during a raid. They've managed to hide this artifact away since, but now they've decided to move it to the Tularian Caves for safekeeping. We've sent a raiding party of our own to get the artifact from them before they're able to get it into the caves. I would ask that you assist our forces in returning the artifact's return. Thank you, Ellen Rockway. So, this quest is happening right now. So, game save. First thing I'm going to do is, since I saved, I'm going to TP back to Castle Harm Nails, see if I can see the flags. Which I can't. Flags are on the outside, maybe? I know that the flags change. Oh, anyway, let's load from our quick save, and let's head over. This is one of the easiest quests in the game. The only problem with the quest is that you have to basically arrive in either Arathia or Tularian Forest during the events of the quest, and it only lasts for a very short period of time. And in fact, most players of Might Magic 7 never even realize this quest exists, because you have to hit it at the exact right moment. So, we fly over to here, we'll start seeing two groups of green to us. They're all fighting each other. Which is fine. None of them are hostile to us because we haven't pissed anybody off. But what we actually want is right here. You'll notice that this little outcropping didn't exist before. They actually slightly changed the map to make this work. So, Griffinhorn's Trumpet. An artifact from a previous elf-human dispute lost by Terence Griffinhart in a daring nighttime raid by elvish forces. Rumor has it that no army that has fought on the side of this trumpet's music has ever been defeated. Even if the rumor is false, it will certainly boost morale on either side. Can I actually play it? Okay. Anyway, the only point of the quest is to grab it and leave. There's nothing else here. Now, um... Current quests. Retrieve Griffinheart's trumpet from the battle in the Chilarian Forest and return it to whichever side you choose. So you can return it to the elves to get the elven reward. Or to get the elves to win. You can return it to the humans to get the humans to win. But we're not going to have either one of them win. Now, are we? We're going to win. And we have to do this very fast. Um, the next step of the quest will trigger while we're working on this quest. It's not, oh, hey, look, I grabbed the trumpet in time. No, you could... Grab the trumpet, and then the next stage of the quest is going... Alright, next stage of the plot is going to trigger, and now the trumpet's useless. Totally happens. But, we're not going to worry about that, because we're awesome. So, we're going to return the trumpet to the Arbiter. Judge Gray. You are wise to return the trumpet to me. Now I can use it to help shore up the weak side in this conflict and promote peace. Thank you. Now let's see if we have a flag, because we've completed all of the wartime quests. Uh, double speed. There's no reason to go single speed here. There's no enemies left. I've killed them all. Oh, don't worry. There'll be enemies again here at some point, but... No flags on the outside. Oh yeah, this guy always is very happy to see people for some reason. Here's the flag. The flag in this case is that of 
earth with a sword through it. You'll notice that that does not match the flag of either Avli or uh, Arathia. Which is nice. Now all we have to do is wait again. We have a few days left until the next trigger happens. Lots of waiting. It's the my probably my biggest problem with Might Magic Seven, but it makes thematic sense. It's not like Might Magic Six where no, time doesn't matter. Do I have a way of increasing my might yet? I know I'm going to be able to once I get Day of the Gods, but I don't have Day of the Gods right now. I need 50 might. How close am I? Seven. <laughs> Not close at all. Got it. Never mind. Um, yeah. Easiest way to waste time would be a map crossing. But, I mean, at this point, it doesn't matter if we waste too much time. We're going to be told. Do you need medical attention? When bad things happen. Take care. So we're going to go clean out a bit more of a dungeon. Oh, that's a bad idea. I really need to master... Oh. Uh, no, that would be a bad idea, too. I... Stupid lack of Lloyd's Beacon. Everybody who can be a master is, okay. Um, I really need my Lloyd's Beacon. So, only because Tolarian, or, um, Tatalia is so glitched right now. I... <sighs> yeah, let's go to Tatalia. Tatalia is a walk from here. Yes, I'm actually walking. Because I'm trying to waste time. And I didn't even waste enough time anyway. I think somebody might have had trolls on that. No, that's right. The month's already changed, so that wouldn't do anything. There we go. Oh, nope. I have the complete set of paintings. I'm confused. Did I drop a painting at some point by accident? Did I not pick up the correct paintings out of... Oh. I just realized. I'm gonna do that first. And I just got an email. A YouTube reply. Okay. Okay, so, um, wait, my, uh, I should have loaded autosave, not quicksave, because I want to be in Arathia, because I'm going to ninja my way through here, because I think what happened is that I forgot to grab the last painting out of uh, Castle Grivenheart. So yeah, you can see what Castle Griffinheart's flags look like. And we've actually seen the other one as well, but uh, I think it was this side that I might be missing. I think I'm actually missing Archibald Ironfist's painting. Pretty sure this is the one I have. Yes, that's Roland's. Oh, sorry. I mirror imaged which side was which. Ninja, ninja. Actually, that might be further down this way. Come to think of it. Uh, nope. Really was the other direction. Meh. Zoom. Zoom. It's in one of these 
these two rooms here. Not that one. Not that one? Handicaps? That one. There we go. Uh, I should have written it better on my quest log. For most of these, I've been writing them as if there's like two quest objects in the same area, I write it twice. In this case, I only wrote it once. That was my fault. And for some reason, the rolling iron fist one was the one I thought I already had. All right. Zoom. Wonderful! The set has eluded me for years. You're more than, you more than deserve the reward I promised. Here, hopefully this will be sufficient. Right. Um, we need to master a couple things here. Also, we have I haven't spent any of our level up skill points, and there's a dungeon in here we haven't touched. Not that I particularly want to touch that dungeon right now. Dagger Grandmaster is going to be a while. That's the dungeon. It's the wine cellar. Has some of the nastiest creatures in the game. Here we go. Freaking finally. I learned it. I can't learn that. I learned it. Okay. We've learned some two new body magic spells. Great. Oh yeah, while we're here, can I actually figure out what I was missing in here before? Because I do have a lot better perception skill than I had before. So I'm hoping to see something glowing red. I need to actually cast my buff spells, though. That would help. Ah, what a scratch. And bless. Ah, what a scratch. There we go. There. Now it's condition green in here. It's disarmed. Hmm. It's actually a nice spell. Sorry, no room. You're gonna find room for that eventually. This is worthless. Hmm. Pardon items, potions are always helpful. It's disarmed. Excerpt from diary. Finally managed to rid myself of that cursed land. I have enough problems. I certainly didn't need them compounded by a centuries-old elf-human conflict. Fortunately, my scheme worked perfectly. That little group accepted a territory I couldn't pay to have someone else take. Now all there is left is secure my position in car. Yeah, that's basically just showing how much of a dick Lord Markham is. Hmm. And the rest of these are not useful. It's disarmed. Ooh. Ooh. That's hmm. worth money. Alright, now we've actually finished this place. Sorry, that was bothering me. It's like, I know there's something. There's got to be a button somewhere. This is why perception is a good skill, because you don't have to remember these things. Alright. Do you need medical to take care? I'm trying to remember what other skills might be useful here. I should probably... <coughs> uh, repair item master. Already master, okay. Disarm trap expert. I'm definitely an expert already. Chain expert. My only chain user is an expert already. Arms master expert. Yep, two people who can be are stealing Grandmaster. Can't do that anytime soon. Uh, what day of the month is it? Thursday. If it was Sunday, I would actually consider going to even more already. 
I mean, there's nothing on even Morn Island that's dangerous to us to speak of. It's more just, ugh. What's the point of going to an island if you can't teleport back? I mean, I can teleport back. I just can't easily return there. You know what? Instead of doing that, how about I get smart and actually look at my stupid quest log? Um, that's not that Chrome window. Not quest log. Um, trainer location. Here we go. So we are in Tatalia. Tatalia, Master, we've got Mace Master and Repair Master. Okay, that's it. That's that's not even true. Body Magic Master is here. Oh, and it just got mixed in the wrong spot. Okay. All right. Um, well, poop. That was supposed to take long enough. Okay, got that. I'm never going to bother throwing points at Mace. It's not worth it. Um, so yeah, I can use a spear in one hand now. But that one hand is always the left hand, which is the reason why you need to be a master in sword to use a sword in your right hand. Or, sorry, it's always in your right hand and you need sort of, you know, I always forget what hand people are. Anyway, um, might as well. Where's body Oh, that's right, it was like Daya or somewhere, which we'll be back in Daya soon enough, but not yet. And, okay, so we've got points left here and we're going to need to start worrying about Grand Mastery. Not that we can Grand Master yet, but there's nowhere else to put points. So I'm going to throw them into Arms Master. Just because Grandmaster Arms Master is a way better bonus than Grandmaster or anything else. So let's just add to AC. That adds... I mean, Grandmaster Plate is really nice, too, come to think of it. Uh, this actually permanently has the Shield Spell cast on you, which I guess is nice, but not really needed. So I guess Arms Master and Plate are the ones that make the most sense. For you, um, you're going to want Grandmaster Dagger pretty quick. Grandmaster Leather Armor is actually really nice because you get plus 10 to every resistance for free. Because 10 is Grandmaster level. Um, you can't go beyond Arms Master Master, so there's no reason to even bother. Disarm Trap, you have no reason to even go beyond Master because... Triple effect at plus 10 bonus is more than high enough to disarm every trap in the game. I suppose. So we'll go with dagger, then leather, then stealing. You only have eight points left at this point. Um, throw more in meditation. You have it, and she hasn't needed more spell points recently now that she actually has enough. And bodybuilding is basic, yeah. Um, start looking at Grand Mastery of Things, so that's going to be body magic for sure. And then you. Like that. Oops. <laughs> Just jump in the air for joy. Uh, okay. Where the hell do I go from here? I was expecting the war to be over. I didn't realize how far off I was of that. Um, yeah. Yeah, this is not great. I'm thinking about just walking into a dungeon and killing things for the rest of the episode. Uh, I can waste more time by doing another map travel. Yes. Actually, I know what I want to do. Um, let's take a look at the skills that we have and figure out which ones I need to move that over there. Move that slightly over so I can see both at once. There we go. All right, so I need to do Master Sword. 
Master Swords and Dea. So let's actually let's create a new tab of our OneNote. And now I'm going to apologize for the keyboard because I'm going to make a lot more noise. So um, we need, and this is in Dea. Where's the headings? Well, it doesn't matter. Okay, all right, next thing that we need over here, Bodybuilding Master is also Dea. Okay, we're done with that for now. Arms Master, Master is Avli. thing we need on here is disarm trap master which we haven't actually done that really that's in Harmondale how did I miss that oh well, I, I mean I guess my disarm traps high enough where I can disarm most things even without it but uh, stealing master in Dea. Of course it is. It really sounds like we're going to be walking over to Dea. Um, okay, we're done with that. We need Mind Magic Master. Avli. Okay. Uh, Merchant. Even Morn. Which even this FAQ types it as ever ever mourn, so I feel justified. Uh, so that's master. Uh, repair item we're already master at. Earth magic. That is Tularian forest. We can do that. And yeah, I misspelled that, didn't I? Yeah, I did. It doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, ID Monster. Avli. And that's it. Okay. So first, let's handle the easy ones. Although that means I have to leave here, doesn't it? So I haven't gotten the quest to go in here. The mercenary killed. Is this actually a completely optional dungeon? This has all the makings for adventure. So this is a dungeon where, in theory, hey look, they've got like murder holes so they can shoot you through them, except in reality, the enemies here are too dumb to actually shoot through them. Good job, game. You could have at least tested that ahead of time. It's like, this is a neat concept, but the implementation is atrocious. Ah, what a scratch. Uh-oh. Yeah. These are the replacements for archers from, um, whatchamacallit, Might Magic 6. I prefer the Might Magic 6 ones, even though they're dressed up a bit sexist because they were actually threatening. These guys aren't. Bring on a bigger challenge. Ow. Oh yes. Ah, what a scratch. And the game crashed. Good job, game. A plus. <sighs> okay, well I guess I won't be doing that. I will come back to that later. Maybe I should just stop it here. It's a slightly early, but I've gone slightly late for most of these. Yeah, I'm going to go stop this recording here, then start it back up, picking up all of our masteries and so on. Because that's a good way to waste time.
Hope you've enjoyed an internet, and I will talk to you next time. Bye!